I'm going to show you another one of the sauces that we uh, use at Yellowfin. We call this our lemon butter sauce, but uh, it's also known as a beurre blanc. Quite simple. The way we do it here is we've got white wine, we've got some white vinegar, and in here we've got some bay leaf, some black peppercorn, some sea salt, and because I've used quite a dry white wine, we've got a touch of uh, white sugar as well. Right, that's going to go into here. We're going to put this on the stove, and we're going to reduce that down a bit. Right, so we've got our ingredients in there. We're also going to add some lemon juice and just some pouring cream. Traditionally, this sauce does not have cream in it, but it just helps to stabilize it a little bit. It enriches it as well. So we're going to give that a good mix around. Okay, so this is reduced a little bit. Um, now we add the butter. Now you're going to say, oh my God, what a lot of butter. But this is actually for the restaurant tonight, so this will serve quite a few people, not just one. Um, so in we go. Butter's going straight in. Now we want to keep this moving the whole time, because the butter will slowly melt into the sauce without splitting. Round and round we go. Now we're going to keep stirring this the entire time until all this butter is melted. Otherwise, what we'll find is the fat will rise to the top and we're going to have a split sauce. Now by keeping this moving the whole time um, and using cold butter, this will incorporate it nice and evenly into the sauce. And then we're going to put this through a little strainer to take out our bay leaf and our black peppercorns. Now we're going to just strain it. We're going to take out the peppercorns and the bay leaves after they've infused their uh, flavour into the sauce. Now this sauce needs to be kept warm. You cannot put it in the fridge. You cannot let it go cold because the butter will harden and your sauce will split. That's a lemon butter sauce, also known as a beurre blanc. It's such a versatile sauce, you can make it in under five minutes. Uh, it's great with fish, also great with chicken, veal. You can add what you like to it. We actually blend up some uh, nice fresh oysters into it. And add diced tomato, you can add cape, chopped capers, you can add herbs, and it adds a touch of class to most dishes.